What is going on, Rebels and Rebelettes? Welcome back to an episode of our Pokemon Soul Silver Egglock. In the last episode, we made our way down to Azalea Town, and we made our way past the Union Cave, and we saw a Team Rocket member. Um, now this guy was a little aggressive towards the young, uh, towards this young man, or I wouldn't say young man, but old man over here. Let's see what he has to say. Stop walking away from me, dude. We have this tough guy called Kurt in this town. He should be able to take care of it. I meant to do like that weird SpongeBob lady from SpongeBob. She's like, we're selling chocolate. That 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 one lady. But yeah, she um. I'm gonna do, I'm I think I'm gonna do that voice for Kurt. You know, cause he's a he's a tough guy. You know, so I'm gonna try and make him sound like a kind of a butch kind of tough guy. And don't worry, I, I haven't forgot about you know uh, team preview you know all the other stuff. I'll show you guys you know what's going on in a in a minute. But I want to do this real quick, huh? <clears throat> Huh? Who are you? Mr. Gay? You wanna make you some balls? Sorry, but I'll have to wait. Do you know Team Rocket? Aw, oh, don't worry, I'll tell you anyhow, cause I'm a tough guy. Team Rocket's an evil gay and they use his Pokemon for their dirty work. They're supposed to have disbanded three years ago. Anyway, they're at the way cutting up soapbook tails for sale. So I'm gonna give them a lesson in PAIN! <laughs> the rest is up. Hang on, Soapbook. Old Kurt is on his way! All right, so <laughs> that was a great start to this episode. Woo! All right, so real quick uh, team update: we got Valkyse at level 11 with the same moves as last time. We got uh, Tesla the same moves as last time. <clears throat> Helmstor same stuff as last time. Apex the same moves as last time. Trico same moves as last time. And I leveled up Furry level 13, and she's got Pound, Defense, Curl, Endure, and Frustration. Bummer there weren't any egg moves on her because I know that um, Baneri's uh, get uh, Ice Punch and Fire Punch, and they're honestly really, really good egg moves to have. I believe they actually get all the elemental punches. I'm pretty sure I'm right. And you know, with that, you know, in Mega Low Punny, it beautiful Mega. I am so glad I drafted that Mega this year for my uh, league I'm in. Because you guys are wondering, I'm in the league called the MPL, and that uh, is on my secondary channel. Would upload those here, but. I mean, I'll be honest, I post com and a lot of people want to see live com battles. I don't concentrate well when I do, um, live com battles, so I gotta do my stuff post com. but anyways. Um, I know you guys would probably want to see Furry, but a lot of our other Pokemon in the party need to get leveled up before we take on this here gym leader. This gym leader is gonna come and kick our asses, it's not looking good for us, so. Um, does this gain no confusion, because I know a lot of these guys use poison Pokemon, but, um, luckily we do have the Powder Snow, that might actually do some pretty good damage, and Kah! That's level 11 as well, so. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go ahead and keep Valkais up front because uh, Valkais is gonna be pretty useful. Well, I mean, in the next gym, I believe that Kabuto is obviously the best. I mean, no, no doubt about that in my mind. Um, Kabuto uh, will definitely come in handy because of ancient power. So I think after when, like, you know, Valkais gets like level 12. I may actually, um, I forgot to do that. Whoops. There's actually a super potion right here too, so that's, that, that's pretty interesting. So I, I saw one or two of you guys yesterday in my comments telling me that some of you guys want to see me actually, you know, not fast forward through the battles. And I don't necessarily have an issue with that, but these episodes are only supposed to be about, you know, 15 to 25 minutes long. I know it's like a long span, but you know, sometimes I, if I want to show extra stuff, you know, I'm going to go do that. But usually the episodes, you know, anywhere from like 15 to 20 minutes. If I were to, you know, go through all the trainer battles without fast forwarding them, the episode would take forever and we would make no progress with the game. And I know a lot of people out there in my audience don't really feel like sitting down watching an episode for 45 minutes, you know, of just me talking about the trainer battles and like what they're going to do because, I mean, you know what? They're trainer battles. You know, I don't have to, you know, that was a moment. That was a moment. I stand corrected. I don't have to, you know, go around the train battles, you know, and like discuss, you know, like what just happened because it's on the screen. You, you obviously saw Ekans use Bite on Valkais. It's on the screen. I don't, I don't have to say, you know, what goes on. Okay, so he he went for this. I'm gonna go ahead and go for this. You know, does this more damage? I don't need to do that. Okay, so right here, I'm gonna go potion up. 
Um, and then the next thing I'm gonna do is, is I'm gonna go do this. Okay, he went for he went for that attack. That that's fine. I'm not the I'm not that kind of commentator, and like I don't plan on being one of those kinds of commentators. Cause I don't know. I, I feel that that commentary is just like really really like boring. No, I'd rather you know just like talk, you know, and sound like a broken record. Ramble on, you know, about stuff that's been going on in my life, you know, like that's like part of the reason why I love doing Let's Plays is because I can actually sit down and talk to you guys, you know, and like when something does happen though, you know, you guys aren't expecting it. Like, for example, like I remember one time in like one of like, my old Let's Plays, I was talking about <clears throat> something very, very important. I think it was like my college or something. And <clears throat> what happened there was I had, I had a Pokemon die, and I was like, yeah, well, I'm gonna watch your call. And like my jaw just drops because of like how, how like amazing the moment was. And if I were talking about you know the game, I would have been expecting that. And you know I'd rather you know if a Pokemon were to die, I'd rather have like the more surprising interaction. That's why I don't choose to talk about that kind of stuff because I don't know to me it's just it's more entertaining you know, to talk about life and you know stuff. I mean the only time I'm obviously going to talk about the game is if I'm in like a really really like big pinch or like a big predicament or if I'm in the middle of a gym battle and there or you know if there's like a really really important like battle coming on like for example um I believe we're going to be battling Proton I won't fast forward to that battle because that is an important battle I only fast forward through the really really stupid battles the ones that really make no sense like you know just like these these dumb grunt ones you know I can do go ahead and you know and do common you know do voices for every single one of these guys but I feel that you know only doing voices in there for like the main NPC you know are probably what's best it makes the most sense see for, for example I, I would love to do um whatchamacallit, uh, freaking, uh, voices for this guy. I don't, I don't have a problem with that. That's totally fine. <clears throat> and I, I, did, I did a voice for Kurt. So, see? Watch this. What do we have here? I'm often labeled as the scariest and cruelest guy in Team Rocket. I strongly urge you not to interfere with our business. This guy ain't jacking around. I'm telling you, he's, uh, ooh, he's ready. So I get a proton. I knew it was Proton too, so I'm gonna go ahead and go ahead and use the uh, Aqua Jet. I think that was some pretty good damage. See, I'm gonna talk about that when there's an important battle going on. <clears throat> oh no, he went for Leech Life. Whatever will I do? Ah, uh, did you only get one damage back? Yeah, screw you too, you piece of shit. I love Pokemon. Um, ground type attacks don't work on it. Furry would die. Too much defense. Tesla. Nah, I'm just gonna stay out here with a Helmser. Oh. I don't think I got my encounter for, um, Slowpoke's well yet. I don't think I ran into anything yet, but. Didn't I run into anything yet? No, because I, I would have I would have remembered. Fast forwarding the game, trying to get away from the Pokemon. I don't, I don't think, think I ran into anything yet. But I am gonna go ahead and go get the encounter for uh, the egg counter for um, Slowpoke's Well. Oh, that didn't do anything. It comes to me. I didn't mean to fast forward. Ah, uh, we're poisoned. Great. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and go for the Aqua Jet. This may actually do more. Uh, not really. I resist it. I do. Okay, good. Are you serious? Did you come here? No, wait. Are you serious? Did you come here with that kind of? I, I, I don't even remember like what he said. Damn it. I'm just gonna go ahead and go for the icy wind. Drop it. Speed. Sonic speed. Sonic team. Sonic speed. Sonic team is ridiculous. They haven't made a good game since Sonic 06. I'm kidding. Uh, my favorite Sonic game is probably Sonic Adventure 2. Love that game. I also like the Sonic Advance series. Uh, I love Sonic Adventure 1. I like Shadow of the Hedgehog. Believe it or not, <clears throat> people like talk trash on Shadow of the Hedgehog. I actually really, really like it. Yeah, I've, I've always thought of Shadow of the Hedgehog as like a good game. And I believe we can survive. We can survive, like, I think, like two more poisons. Okay. I mean, we, we won anyway, so it's all good. I got my cannon to dry. This. I've had it here since like last night. Forgot to kind of like, throw it away. I love in that kind of world. My whole entire room is trash. Okay, not, not really. But, you know, sometimes I got like empty water bottles and stuff on my desk, you know. You know, long, you know, long day working out being a Pokemon, you know. 
best stuff to do that. You know, first off, you know, I wake up, you know, I... Oh, uh, boy, I am. <laughs> Team Rocket was indeed broken up three years ago, but we continued our activities underground. A small obstacle like you won't be much of a problem for our mission, Mystic Boy. I advise you to be very afraid of what is to come. If you guys know what voice I was trying to interpret, it's from the Yu-Gi-Oh! series. If you guys um know what that is, comment below. Way to go, Mystic! Team Rocket has taken off! My back spitter too, let's get out of here! I'm a tough guy! Hi Mystic, you handled yourself like a real hero! As I mentioned before, Team Rocket was disbanded by a boy called Red three years ago. Now that they have come back, I have a bad feeling about it. In any case, it would please me greatly to make Pokeballs for a trainer like you. This is all I have now, but take it. But the fast ball, gotta go fast ball. This guy's giving me a headache. You have apricorns for me? Fine, I'll turn them into Pokeballs. Yeah, take my green one. I did. Uh. Yeah, yeah, for the mouse. It took a day to make your, your Pokeball. Come back for it later. <clears throat> I made voice crack here. That's right. I'll give you my grandpa's number. Oh, so bad. Ugh. I hate this deep voice. It sucks. My grandpa can play more money for corns. Oh god, my voice is so bad. Luckily, this is generation four. Um, it does not add a poison, so we are good. We are good. We be good. We be good. I don't even know how much time we, we've been recording for. Damn. Uh, I, forgot, I forgot my phone. It's alright. My phone's right here. No problem. So we're going to go. Oh god, not this. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and go pull up random number generator because we need to get a Pokemon for the. Um, pretty sure I didn't run into an encounter on a freaking the um, what you call it? Inside Slowpoke Swell. I don't. I don't remember me doing it. I don't know because I would have remembered, you know, like having to fast forward away from it. I believe we didn't, so. <clears throat> I'm just gonna go ahead and sit here and just go capture it real quick. Pretty sure I didn't. You know what? What I'll do is, is rather than that, I'll just look back in like my previous recording and see if I did get any, if I did get an encounter in there, and then the next episode we'll, we'll go get it. Oh shit! But if I were to go and go, ugh, I can't do that because then I have to battle this douchebag over here. There's a rival battle right after you, uh, you do the Team Rocket thing. And I do not feel like battling my rival. My rival will like go and like crush me. Will go and like crush like my hopes and dreams. So I'm actually just gonna go inside the gym. I'm gonna go try my luck at uh, Bugsy. <clears throat> so I'm not gonna get any eight counters for this episode. We will go get eight counters in the next episode. Where that way I can get both eight counters together in Elix Forest and in Slowpoke's Well if I did not miss it. Cause sometimes you know I, I just lose track of things and. And I just, I just misplace stuff, or you know, I, I forget to go get something. You know, I, I'm like so into like talking to you guys, I forget the stupid, I for, always forget the damn encounters. I hate when that happens. It pisses me off. I'm gonna write down on like a piece of paper, like don't, like don't forget like, to go get the fucking encounters because it's, <laughs> it gets irritating after a while. But yeah, with this gym, um, I remember back in Generation Two, and all you have to do was just walk around to Bugsy, and then you could battle him automatically without any problems. I mean, you could even, like, skip a couple trainers. With these guys, in Generation 5, you know, I mean, Generation 4, you can't really do that, so... I've always thought of it, you know, as, like, kind of irritating, but, I mean, you know, it, it is cool, you know, that they raise the difficulty a bit. No, I'm not really, you know, all that mad. I'm gonna, you know, train some Pokemon in here as well. I'm gonna go ahead and train, um... I think I'm gonna train Valkais for a little while. A lot of these Pokemon are bug and flying types, and Valkyas could actually get a little bit of a workout from battling one of these guys, so we're all good. In the hood. The puns need me to stop right now. Go ahead and potion up. I got three potions left. I think what I'm gonna do is, is I'm actually going to go buy some potions just in case, because you never know what kinds of problems you can deal with when you're fighting up against these guys, and trust me, it's not... It's not exactly the greatest thing in the world, we you know, when you gotta go do that kind of stuff. 
uh, I'm only allowed, you know, three healing items per battle as well. I mean, I'd rather, you know, buy more potions just because I'm going to need them for the future anyways. I have one super potion, sure, but, you know, three potions, you know, isn't going to cut it. And, um, I will take care of the... I'll probably buy about five of them. I'll take care of these, um, these gifts that uh, the mom gave me in another episode when we have more time. Right now, all I want to do is, all I want to do is, I just want to get to Bugsy. I, I want to get in front of Bugsy before the episode ends. And then I'm going to, um, I'll probably battle in this episode. I'm literally not too sure yet. We'll see what happens. Either that or I may have you guys wait just because I, I'm, I'm that kind of person. I'm going to be like, okay, guys, now you got to wait till next episode. Great. That's fine. I, I, I prefer the extra battles anyways. Totally intentional. I'm just going to go ahead and just go for some Powder Snows. That's all there is to it. <clears throat> Our Pokemon need to be in a lot more tip-top shape you know, before we take on Bugsy. And a lot of the uh, Pokemon are also going to be a little bit higher level than you know from here on out. You know, these Pokemon need a really good... I may do a Granite Montage, I may not. I mean, a few of our Pokemon are up to level. Like, um, for example, I'm gonna say, you know, up to level, up to level, but, you know, they're not doing... God, freaking... Oh my god. Go back. Okay, so it's definitely this one over here. I don't know why, sometimes I just forget <clears throat> where to go. Okay, good. Making sure I'm not screwing anything up. Because I guess it's annoying after all, I know when he constantly screwed things up. Okay, so I, I'm gonna have to battle these twins, this shouldn't be all that big of a deal. You know, I'll go ahead and, you know, and I'll go ahead and put this, uh, this one on camera. <clears throat> hey, are you challenging the leader? No way! If you insist, we'll be your opponents. Voice crack. Hardcore. I can't do, like, these little kid voices anymore. My voice is just too deep. Like, I... I can't do it, man. I can't do it. Alright, so Valkais and Tesla. Uh, Valkais, you go into... I, I can actually attack both and I've been bad. Oh, but goodness me. We're probably gonna have to get to the gym leader in the next episode because we are running out of time. And not to mention, I have to get past these guys. Oh, I'm just gonna go and fast forward this. I know I said I was gonna do it, but let's just fast forward. Not that big of a deal. Oh, see, that was quick. Oh goodness, I'm feeling a bit dizzy. I don't see how you feel a bit dizzy. Maybe I, get, I guess the Pokemon made him dizzy or something. I, I would have no idea. So now, are we gonna get sent over to the other switch? Yes, we are. Good. I, so I think we're gonna be in front of the gym leader now. That's that's a relief. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna go ahead and save in front of the gym leader. And I think that should be good enough for now. So, if you guys did enjoy this episode, I'm gonna act- Oh my god. Backwards. So I think I'm actually gonna end off the episode here. If you guys did enjoy the episode, um, you know, be sure to leave a like, you know, subscribe, share this video with a friend, do all the other great stuff. And with that being said, I th yeah, this is about time to go. I'm gonna see you guys in the next episode, so don't be sad. Woo!